Let's start with the pie. Well, I don't know how to cook that. So easy. I've made a whole bunch of different pies in my career, so the recipe is already in my blood. First, I need to make the dough. To do this, we'll need flour, milk, and of course, eggs. I will break them like a real master. I'm sure none of you know how to crack an egg on a knife plate. It's really cool. Well, now I have to mix all these ingredients. I will use this special mixer. My dough is almost ready. All I need is to roll it out. But it's much harder than I thought. It constantly sticks to the rolling pin. But I have a way to fix this. I just need to cover the dough with baking sheets. On both sides. Ready. Now I have to cut the dough. Looking good. That looks really hard. Why not just use some regular bread? I think it will be easier. Well, it's time to do the filling. I will need apples and berries. My granddaughter will definitely like this. And it's very healthy. So boring. I will use Nutella. Everyone likes it. And I'm sure Tina does too. This is so fun. I would eat this myself. I need to make a nice top layer for my pie. So I will need my special mold. Oh, I found it. I will use it to make these beautiful hearts out of dough. This is so beautiful. Now all I have to do is cover the pie. It's a masterpiece. I need to put this in the oven. And just wait until it's cooked. I have another great idea! Rainbow marmalades! This will look amazing! My pie is ready. Oh, that's disgusting and very unhealthy. Well, girls, your pies are nothing compared to my work of art. My pie will be very colorful. It will make it more interesting. Now I have to mix this very well. And now I have to pour the dough into containers. And put it in the microwave. This is so beautiful. Now all I need is to glue everything together with the help of this white cream. This is the perfect filling for any cake or pie. And it's beautiful not only in the outside, but also inside. The more cream I use, the better it will taste. I'm almost done. But that's not all. I will use these colored chocolate bars. They will make my pie even more beautiful. I need to cut the bars in pieces. Perfect. And now it's time to heat this chocolate. I will do that with a burner. This looks so cool. And it's much easier. Now I will use a puppet as a mold. I have the right colors here. And when the chocolate hardens, I will put it on the top of my pie. Look how lovely it turned out. Such a beautiful and very original piece of cake. Just like in all expensive restaurants. Wow. Tina, we are ready. Well, well. First, I will try this bread with marmalade. It's an unusual combination. But I don't really like it. Nothing special. Let's move on. I will see what my granny prepared for me. It smells really good. So yummy! And now it's time for the brightest and most beautiful pie I've ever seen in my life! It's so bright! And not only in the outside, but also inside! Okay, stop talking! It's time to try! Mmm, it's just brilliant! Jamie, congratulations! You won! Oh, thanks! I tried very hard!